Hi, my name's Shauna. I'm with Fox and Doll Makeup, and we're here with Mindy getting ready for today's style book shoot. So we're going to do a classic take on the vintage cat eye look, and so right now we're just starting with a really nude base for the eyes, but we're going to kind of take it in a more modern direction with adding some shimmer. So I'm just laying a couple of nude colors. We started with a flat nude base and now we're doing a shimmery nude just all over the eyelid. And then with a smaller brush I'm adding a little bit of highlight right under the brow bone with a lighter color. I'm going to take that same frosty white and just dab it right here in the corners of Mindy's eyes. I'm just going to give a little pop and then I'm just re-blending everything. I'm doing eyes first in case you have fallout that comes down onto your cheeks so then you can clean any of that up and get a fresh clean face. So right now we're adding the black cream liner and with this it's kind of a process of building the color. Um, so we start with a real thin line across your lash line with a little bit of a winged tip at the end and you just kind of want to build it thicker and thicker until you get the angle and shape that you want. All with kind of bringing it up right at the end of the eye before you get to the corner so you create a little bit of a lift. For liner, I suggest either using a cream liner or a liquid liner. You want to kind of experiment with both to see what you're most comfortable with. A uh, cream liner is going to give you kind of a softer line, whereas a liquid liner is going to be a little bit of a like harsher, shinier, detailed line. Just adding a little bit of powder um, to the brows just to define them a little bit. Don't I don't want to totally like draw in anything that's not there. I'm just kind of going over the natural shape and arch, a little powder and a little bit of wax over that. So we're doing a primer on Mindy's skin, um, mostly because this is an all day shoot that we're doing and um, she's gonna be under some warm lights and we really wanna make sure that it lasts. I wouldn't necessarily recommend this for everyday makeup, um, but for a special occasion, a long day, um, it can be worth the extra step. So we're just doing a really sheer um, coverage of foundation. We just want to create a real even skin tone, um, even out any redness, but we don't want to mask Mindy's face. She's got beautiful skin. We still want it to shine and glow through. So we've just curled the lashes with a lash curler just to kind of help open open the eyes up a little bit, uh, help with that doe-eyed look that we're creating. And um, now I'm going to go in with a couple coats of a black mascara. And you really want to work the mascara through the base of the lashes, up through the ends. And just keep going over them a couple times to get them really well coated. And now we're adding some individual lashes, just um, a little bit of dab of glue on the end of them and then placing them um, sort of focused on the outer part of Mindy's eyes. I'm just powdering her lips just to neutralize them a little bit um, to get them ready for a really bright, vibrant color that you want to last and not feather out. Also a lip pencil that's a similar color is also going to help. So we're using um, Centrifugia lip color from Lime Crime, and it is fuchsia, beautiful holiday color. And with a bold color like this, I like to refine it a little bit with a lip brush, just to get a really nice edge and coverage. And there you have it. We have our vintage inspired retro holiday look. Thanks for watching. Perfect. <laughs> Great. Okay, we're going to do your hair.